Y'all, we are going shopping. What's up, YouTube, and welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Mariah Perry, and I'm back again with another video. And in today's video, we are going to Target to replenish on some hygiene products, self care things. And I want to see if I can find some new products that I can try out. I'm taking you guys shopping with me. So we're getting ready to leave. I love, 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 love self-care and hygiene. I decided to make a video, bring you guys to the store, and we just, you know, re-up on products that I already have, see if they have some new products that I want to try. That's just what it is. That's just what it is. And y'all wanna know what is tea? That native body wash that y'all see on TikTok is not it. At least not for me. I tried it. I guess we can talk about it later because we're gonna also do like a haul at the end showing you guys all the products and a review me talking about some products and stuff like that so make sure you guys stay tuned in because it's gonna be fun i've been wanting to go to target for so long i haven't been in the longest so the fact that i'm going to target today just has me in a good mood and the sun is out so i'm feeling good i already have a list of things that i'm getting for sure like things that i know i need to re-up on I feel like a broken tape recorder, like I already said that. I shouldn't be so crazy going around the entire store of Target because I already know what I need. But if I see something that's like, mm, I want to try that. And I know some things I do want to try, but I've never tried before. So anyway, I'm going to stop talking. And we're going to get into it. I'm going to get in a car. And yeah, let's go. Y'all, the pollen is not playing with us at all. My car just looks green. Like a green machine. Anyway, I'm almost at our destination. And y'all know my birthday was last week. I have a birthday gift card to Target from my Aunt Gina. So I'll be spending that today, shamelessly. Thank you, Aunt Gina, if you're watching this. Traffic isn't too bad. I hate traffic. Like, I don't want any other car on the road with me. If there's more than five cars on the road, I consider that being traffic. I'm over exaggerating. We made it. It's lit. Let's go inside and go shopping. Actually, before I go inside, I want to pull up my gift card so I'm not standing in public scrolling through my phone not attentive to my surroundings happy birthday mariah we hope you have a great day enjoy a little something at target from target on us with love aunt gina and uncle Derek. these are the best women's multivitamins and they taste really good they're gummy too so if you don't like to swallow pills this is perfect i heard this is causing people's skin to break out but i'm not sure Dove has a body cleanser. I saw this on TikTok. But there's one with a specific one that she said to try. But I don't think this is it, but it's the same brand. In my last hygiene haul, I tried this, but I'm not really a fan of this one. Kinda wanna try this one. Macadamia and rice milk. Here's the body wash I was talking about that my skin just does not like at all. Y'all, these two body washes smell very similar. And this one's cheaper. So I'm gonna try this one since Native doesn't like me.
I'm leaving the hygiene, I'm leaving to find some candles. I think I found them. to share with you guys what I got from Target old and new you guys know y'all heard the intro so let's go ahead and get started so I'm gonna kind of go down the line of my nighttime routine so starting off before I get in the shower I like to use the bathroom whether it be one or two I hope you guys are comfortable with me talking about this we're all humans I do not like to get into the shower until I use the restroom so with that being said, I'm not a tissue type of girl. I prefer wipes and here are the wipes that I like to use. These are Charmin and they're flushable. I really love flushable wipes because there was a time where I was using wipes and they weren't flushable and I would forget that they're not flushable. These are very soft. These are not fragrance free, but it's never been a problem for me. This box here comes with a pack of eight, but they also have the singles, doubles, and packs of four. You can find these at Target, obviously. I love these wipes, y'all. I really, really, really love Charmin wipes, okay? So before I get in my shower, I love to use big wipes. If I have to use the restroom before I get in the shower, yes. All right, so we're past that. Now, when we get into the shower, this is a body wash that I like to use as of now. So as of right now, I've kind of been into the Dove Sensitive Body Wash. This is the new one. This one is hypoallergenic. I had to say that slow. It's cruelty free. I also like the dark blue top. Um, the deep moisture one so I bounced between that one and this one really good like I said earlier I tried to get into the native body wash but my body just wasn't feeling it so definitely love the sensitive dove body wash it also comes in a bar this one again is not fragrance free but they do have a fragrance free sensitive body wash although this is not fragrance free just like the baby wipes my skin is completely fine with this product nothing bad and it leaves me feeling squeaky clean. So a new product that I picked up that I'll show you guys in the store is the St. Ives Hydrating Body Wash Coconut Water and Orchid. This is made with 100% natural extracts. What drew me to this is because one of the girls that I watch on YouTube was basically saying how this is similar to the Native Body Wash that also has coconut, I think it has coconut and shea butter in it. I'll post a picture of the body wash that I was talking about right here, even though I showed you guys earlier, but this one is plant-based, cruelty-free, paraben-free, dermatologist tested formula, hydrates for soft skin, and it smells literally just like the native body wash so the thing about me is I love trying new body washes which is why I tried native obviously it didn't work so here I am bouncing to a different body wash I like to go in with the Dove sensitive body wash to get completely clean and then go in with a another body wash that has a little bit more fragrance to it so I'm excited to try this out and it's way cheaper than the native body wash and you still get that same scent. I will keep you guys posted and let you guys know if it breaks me out or not. I'm praying that it doesn't because it smells so good. On to the feminine wash. Y'all know if you guys checked out my previous hygiene video, I prefer the honey pot, the original feminine wash, which is the orange one. If they don't have the orange one, I'll get the sensitive one, which is the blue one. Target did not have either. So if Honey Pot is not in stock, I fall back on the Baby Unscented Dr. Bronner soap. This one works perfectly fine. So ladies, if the Honey Pot is ever unstocked, I definitely recommend trying the Baby Unscented Dr. Bronner. It's the light blue one because they have a dark blue one too. Don't get it twisted. Make sure you guys get this one. It doesn't knock off your pH balance. 
it's unscented i know some girls talk about how they don't use any soap down there they just prefer water and let it clean itself but i like to have a feminine wash so it's either the honey pot or dr bronner's every time i go into target the honey pot feminine wash is always out of stock and i just don't understand like if you guys know it's a hot commodity you guys should have it in stock I shouldn't have to be, you know, checking to see if y'all have it in stock or not. I like to go on the Target app and type in the honey pot to see if it's actually in stock. And most of the time it's not in stock. But I heard Walmart has it as well. So I might swing by there sometime next week. I'm not really in a rush because I do have this. I did forget to mention with my body wash, I like to use this exfoliating. It's kind of like a loofah in a sense. But it's a little more abrasive than the original loofah this is by earth therapeutics and i got this from ulta i've been using this for about two weeks now and it works so 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 good at first it was kind of like whoa this is a little too rough don't go too crazy with this i like to use it every day your skin gets used to it and i really feel like it gets that dead skin that dirt layer off really good i like to use this with my sensitive body wash and then um with my fragrance body wash i like to use a regular washcloth because i do go in afterwards with a body scrub the body scrubs that i prefer to use are tree huts i get them from ulta anything that i can find at ulta that's in my hygiene routine i like to get because i like to rack up on my points i'm mentioning this in today's video because they do sell tree hut inside of target so this is the vitamin c one i also like the tahitian treat vanilla bean because i'm a warm scent type of person but this smells good as well this is made with shea butter vitamin c and alpha hydroxy acid reveals brighter looking skin works really good i've been using tree hut for the longest i mean the absolute longest so i bounce between the vitamin c and the tahitian treat vanilla bean but I, if you guys watch my vlogs, you guys know that I was talking about this raw sugar sugar scrub. And this is the lemon sugar one. Y'all, this smells so good. In my vlog, I was talking about how it's $13. But today I was like, why not? Because I had a gift card and I really did want to try it. So this says exfoliate, nourish, and renew. Made with plant-derived ingredients and cold-pressed extract. So hopefully this will help me lighten up my armpits so i will keep you guys posted packaging is so cute i love the wood it's not real wood but the design of it is really 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 nice before i go in with my sugar scrub on the days that i do shave my legs and my armpits i like to use the eos shea butter shave cream these are two that i've used before they also have a lavender one this pink one is pomegranate raspberry and this one is vanilla bliss this one in my hand has shea oil shea butter you can shave and it's also an in shower lotion and it works wet and dry the same for this one protective shea butter formula works wet and dry you can use this as a shaving cream as well as a lotion kind of on the pricey side for actual shaving creams but i think they're really really worth it they smell really really good they really help the razor just get that hair out of the follicle to help with a nice clean shave i know some shaving creams they don't really help the razor get the hair out of the follicle if that makes any sense but i feel like eos is very nice and it leaves your skin feeling buttery smooth after a shower. So the Tree Hut body scrub is something that I do like to use after I shave with the EOS shaving cream because it leaves your skin feeling top tier, y'all. The shave plus sugar scrub combo, body scrub combo is top tier, y'all. And y'all know when y'all wash y'all sheets, y'all shave y'all legs after y'all wash y'all sheets and get in the bed, that junk is the best feeling ever. I be rubbing my legs together like this. These are just two regular big razors i got a pack of 10 they sell these at target they also have the same exact razors but they come with the shaving cream already around it i'll see if i can find a picture and post it right here i've tried these razors as well and it worked really good but since my shaving cream works fine by itself without the razor having the shaving cream on it i feel like these work just as nice so this is the big soleil i hope you guys can see it but i will say to 
glide across your leg slow like not extremely slow but i wouldn't rush because you might nick yourself because these blades are sharp okay so just be careful when you are shaving your legs and your armpits with these razors they do their job if you just take care of the product okay now that we have completed the shower portion i'd like to move on to dental y'all know i have braces i can't get the whitening toothpaste the charcoal toothpaste anything that whitens teeth i can't use because if i do use any toothpaste like that it could potentially leave squares on my teeth once i get my brackets removed so i just go for a regular regular toothpaste here's the toothpaste that i get this has cavity protection, strengthens teeth with active fluoride. So I just do the original toothpaste by Colgate. That's really all I have to say about the toothpaste. Here we have the original, we all know, Listerine Cool Mint. I've been using this for the longest as well. I've been wanting to try the purple one because I heard that it still gives you that clean feeling, but it doesn't burn. I don't know what's up with this Listerine Cool Mint. But I've been using it and it works. And another thing that I use for my braces is a water pick. Instead of me using regular dental floss, I like to use my water pick. It really helps with getting into the nooks and crannies of your braces. Not only does it clean in between your teeth, but it also cleans like the brackets themselves because sometimes food can get stuck in your brackets. You having braces, you're not going to always feel food stuck in between things so it's just really nice to do that extra step with a water pick rather than spending forever trying to floss in between braces cleaning your brackets with regular dental floss so i do recommend a water pick i will link the one that i use down below in the description box actually everything that i'm showing you guys will be linked in the description box so make sure you guys check it out hopefully i can link some things to my amazon store but anyways on to body hydration moisturizing armpits and stuff like that i'm not like the tiktok girls with the zero percent aluminum deodorant i like to use secret this is the outlast and olay completely clean scent smooth and solid if you roll this up it comes out of the little holes up here smells good a little bit goes a long way but i will say if you're not careful it will show up on your clothes if you're getting ready to go out make sure you put your top on first and put on your deodorant because if you're not careful it might mess up your shirt and i don't want that to happen to you guys um i'm not a big sweater so i can't really say how will it affect people that sweat a lot? It works perfectly fine. It gets me through the day. Even after a long, 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 long day and I get in my shower and I'm getting ready to wash with my body wash and my exfoliator, I can still smell this deodorant. They weren't lying when it says Outlast. Y'all, I think it's finna rain, but I prefer natural lighting rather than artificial lighting. So I'm gonna briskly go through the rest of this. I am almost done, I promise. Thank you guys so much for hanging in there. We are almost done, okay? Lotion, Vaseline. I recently started using this like a week ago. This is the Almond Smooth. They have a dark brown one, but this one, I feel like this one's better. Now the dark brown one I've used before for a longer period of time, obviously. This one, y'all, this one smells so good. And I'm excited because I got this new Aveeno Daily Moisturizing Oil Mist that smells really, 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 really good, y'all. And the two scents complement each other so nicely. So when I get out of my shower and I put on my deodorant, I put some lotion on and I spray this oil mist, I don't even need my nighttime perfume. Yes, I like to wear perfume at night. This it just does the job do y'all see y'all probably can't see because the lighting is bad but this is it i'm telling y'all run to target and get this Aveeno oil mist it has oat oil and jojoba oil conditions dry rough skin smoother more even skin in one week i will be the judge of that these two right here the scents compliment. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. But we'll see. This is something new that I picked up today. So we'll just see how it goes. Speaking of oil, I have another oil right here. This has shea butter and cocoa butter in it. Just a regular off-brand baby oil. Not gonna lie, this isn't from Target. This is actually from the dollar store. But I still wanted to put that in there because I use it 
it's in my hygiene routine like i said earlier i do like to use like a body mist or a perfume at night usually my dossier perfumes but ec may may put me on to this vaseline all over body balm the jelly stick is basically just vaseline in a stick form definitely something that you can bring when you're traveling on the airplane this is fragrance free but she said that if you just put it in the areas that you're putting on your perfume it helps your perfume to stick even longer so just using the stick end of this and just rubbing it behind your ear on your neck on your wrist and then going in with your perfume we'll see we'll see if the girls be telling the truth okay because i'm gonna let you know i'm gonna let you know i also picked up this hand soap this is the method waterfall foaming hand wash with plant-based cleansers not sure how this smells something new i usually stick to bath and body works hand soaps the foaming hand soaps they literally just had a sale like two days ago but i missed it but i needed some more body wash for my bathroom i picked up one just in case i don't like it but they had different um a variety of different scents and fragrances i hope i was able to get footage of it if not i'm sorry because it's just weird when you're filming and someone's following you in every single aisle make sure y'all stay tuned to my vlogs because i can give you guys updates on some of these new products that i'm trying in my vlog so if you're here you're stuck with me now you have no choice but to hit the subscribe button all right y'all the last thing that i want to share from this hygiene slash self-care video is my cute little candle that I got today. This is black cedar and it has a crackling wood wick. So if you're into, you know, sounds and just therapy, girl, what are you talking about? Y'all know what I mean. If y'all want to hear a crackling wood wick, get this because it smells so good. Perfect for your nighttime routine or during the day, whichever you prefer. I actually like lighting candles all day when I'm at home. As y'all can see, I have a candle right there burning behind me. That's actually one of my friend's candles. Her name is Akila, and she has a candle brand called Carter's Candles. She makes some nice candles. So make sure y'all check her out. I'll put her stuff down below as well, but this is the one that I got from Target today and it smells so good. It's a wooden wick soy blend candle. It's it's more of a masculine scent but i kind of like masculine scents it smells really good but i can't really pick out the notes of this because i'm not a professional candle individual i just know when something smells good i just go ahead and grab it that's just me all right y'all so that concludes today's video i hope you guys enjoyed hanging out with me going to target with me and just sitting and watching this entire video if you did i do want to do an actual video where i kind of walk you guys through and talk about the products more in depth in an actual video like my shower routine or my nighttime routine so let me know in the comments down below if you guys would like to see something like that i had fun sharing some of my products with you all old and new if you are new here go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give me a thumbs up and leave a comment down below and let me know how you guys felt about this video actually leave a comment down below of your favorite body wash and that'll let me know if you made it to this part of the video whether you skipped or watch the whole thing or not i don't care i'm just glad that you're even here watching me leave a comment down below of that and i think that's it you guys now i have to go put these products up in my bathroom but i'm so ready to take a shower tonight like it's gonna be lit i think i'm really just excited about this and my new body scrub thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys in my next video